Being a tortoise makes Tom a very slow waiter. May I take your order? Oh, wiggly worms, please. <laughs> One wiggly worms. Get a move on, Tom. Get a move on. I am moving, Lisa. Being a lemur makes Lisa a very fast waitress. Excuse me, Mrs. P. Oh, my word. Can I take your order, please, Betty? Aye, I'd like one large and two small portions of hot twigs. I want a large portion. I want a large portion, too. Oh, all right. Make that three large portions. Coming right up. One wiggly worms, please, Abe. One wiggly worms. Three hot twigs. Three hot twigs. See, Tom, did you see how quick I was? Yes, you nearly knocked over poor Mrs. Panda. Mrs. Panda, and one bamboo, Abe. One bamboo. Coming right up. One wiggly worms, one bamboo, and three hot twigs. Now, how about that? But I was serving Sophie. Tom, I need to teach you how to be quick, like me. I'm not sure that's such a good idea. Oh, my twigs aren't hot at all. Well, my twigs are wiggling. Ooh, yucky. These aren't worms. I wanted worms. Sorry, Sophie. Oh, help! Help! Whatever's the matter, Mrs. Panda? I've tasted something that doesn't agree with me. What was it? I don't know, but it wasn't bamboo. It was only hot twigs, Mrs. Panda. It won't hurt you. Oh, no. I'm ill now. I shall have to go home and lie down. But you only tasted it. There's only one thing that I like to taste, and that's bamboo, plain and simple. Mrs. Panda does like to make a fuss. Wiggly twigs! Wiggly twigs! Those are Sophie's worms. There we go. Now, everyone has what they ordered, except Mrs. P. I'll take that round to her at home, Lisa. But could you please slow down? Silly Claudia, we should be serving quicker, not slower. Hello, Mrs. Panda. No. Oh. Hello, Claudia. I brought you some bamboo. Oh, that's good, because I didn't have any lunch. I know. Are you feeling better? Of course not. I'm going straight to bed. You won't eat. I can eat in bed. Lisa is still trying to speed Tom up. But I can't go any faster. No need, Tom. Once we get the tables close together, you won't have so far to go. But Lisa... Whee! Woo! Hello, Lisa. <laughs> Could we have a table for two, please? Coming right up. There's one just there in the middle. Ooh. I don't think I can squeeze in there. <laughs> Neither can I. <laughs> yes, you can. Go underneath. Why are the tables all at one side of the restaurant? Oh, maybe they're making room for dancing. Aren't you feeling better yet, Mrs. Panda? Ooh, the light's too bright, dear. Would you mind shutting the curtain? All right, but I must be going. Oh, oh, wait! What's wrong now? It's too dark to see my bamboo. Oh. Do be a dear and open the curtain, will you? Mm. 
one huge salad for Hector and one little nut whistle for Helen. Okay, Tom. Think fast. Serve fast. But I can't reach them. Well, can you go under? I'll spill the food. Can you go over? What do you mean? Walk on the tables. But Lisa... Come on, Tom. I'll hold the plates while you climb up. I don't think this is a good idea, Lisa. Mrs. Panda, I have a restaurant to run. Oh, but I've nearly finished the bamboo. You can take the plate back if you wait. Well, bring it in the next time you come. Cup of tea? Uh, no, thanks. I meant, would you make tea for me? Look at Tom, Mum. Can I try that? No, you may not. Careful, Tom. This is a bad idea. The tables are just a bit wobbly. Oh, perhaps you should put the tables back the normal way. <laughs> yes, there doesn't seem to be anyone dancing at the moment. <laughs> Unless you count Tom. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Mm. Oh, yuck. Mm, I've never had a meal served like that before. Oh, neither have I. Uh, that was funny. <laughs> Do it again, Tom. What's happened here? The table was too wobbly. You see, I was trying to help Tom serve the customers more quickly. We don't need to serve our customers any quicker, but it would be nice to serve them a little more sensibly. Sorry, Claudia. We'll put everything back the way it was. And we'll clear up the mess. Good. But can you do it slowly, please, Lisa? Suddenly. Coming right up. Whee! <laughs> oh dear. Sometimes Lisa has some very silly ideas. But I think Tom was even sillier to go along with her. Don't you?